To illustrate the thermal benefits of an insulated double leaf cavity wall, we will take a sectional view through the wall of this typical house. The insulated double leaf cavity wall is made up of three layers. Two clay brick leaves separated by a thin cavity and a thermal insulation barrier. The insulation barrier can be made up of a number of materials, including expanded polystyrene or polyurethane. The passage of heat through the brick wall begins in the early hours of the day, when the sun first starts to shine. The permeation of heat into the wall is a slow process of about 25 millimeters per hour. It takes several hours for the sun's heat to fully penetrate the outer leaf of bricks and only begins to reach the inner leaf by midday. The insulation barrier then limits the total heat transfer to the inner leaf. The heat flows through the inner leaf as the afternoon continues, but at a much lower rate, thanks to the insulated cavity separating the leaves and results in a far more moderate internal temperature during the hottest part of the day. As the sun sets outside, temperatures drop and the heat flow slowly begins to reverse as the thermal energy is drawn out of the bricks by the cold of the night. The draw of internal heat is thankfully limited due to the insulation barrier. By the early hours of the morning, outside temperatures reach their lowest and all the heat is completely drained from the outer leaf of bricks. However, the inner leaf, thanks to the insulation barrier, retains its stored heat achieving a far more moderate internal temperature during the coldest part of the night. The insulation barrier moderates this internal heat loss. Let's run through that again. On a typical day where the outside surface temperature drops to about 10 degrees early in the morning, might reach as high as 30 degrees by midday or early afternoon. While in normal uninsulated systems, the interior surface temperature will drop as low as 16 degrees. But thanks to the insulation barrier, we only see a drop to about 18 degrees. The interior surface again shouldn't rise above 20 degrees and this high point is offset to the early evening just as it's cooling off outside. Thanks to the thermal density of clay brick and the insulated double leaf cavity wall, the outside temperature peaks are moderated and a comfortable interior temperature is maintained throughout the day. This clearly illustrates the thermal efficiency of an insulated clay brick system and the benefits of saving energy and heating costs in your home.